Hey everybody, this is John with My Small Business Blueprint. I wanted to reach out to you today. I uh, uh, had a, a group of uh, students uh, that I was working with earlier today and we were talking about competitive advantage and you know all the different strategies that we can use to kind of increase what our real tangible competitive advantage is going to be in the marketplace. And one of the things we talked about was actually focusing solely on the value that you provide uh, to your clients and outsourcing all those other operations that either uh, don't make sense or are key to you in being in business uh, but don't add uh, or don't bring any additional value back to the business. And so I, I left that class today and was just doing some research and reading some articles and uh, what you see on here is from Columbus Underground. It's actually from last year, from last October, uh, but I found it via the Metropreneur here in Columbus and I wanted to give a shout out to, to Lauren Sega here for first of all wrote the article, but then also the two companies that are involved with this. And if you look at it, as I was reading through, it's really a great opportunity to see competitive advantage kind of uh, take real uh, a real step into the marketplace and how people can uh, reinforce what they do well and also how they provide uh, additional benefits to their network uh, as well. So if you look at Double Comfort, uh, one of the restaurants located downtown, and then Food for Good Thoughts, uh, both of the companies in this article uh, have different strengths, do different things, but they're able to join forces and really ramp up some efforts when it came to uh, donating food uh, to some of the local food pantries, food banks uh, in central Ohio. And the one uh, comment that really stuck with me here, and uh, I'm going to highlight it here for you on the screen, is from, uh, I believe it's Mary Liskey who owns uh, Double Comfort Restaurant. I thought, what if I just became the revenue stream? I don't want to reinvent the wheel. I don't want to be another food pantry. But what if I can help the ones that are existing? And I really think that that emphasizes competitive advantage for me, right? Uh, Double Comfort knows what they do extremely well. They know how to serve people. They know how to have great food. And they know how to uh, be profitable in that venture. On the flip side of that, if we want to go, we want to open up a food pantry, that's a completely new problem uh, with all these different tangents that we're going to have to figure out rather than doing something uh, that other people are doing extremely well focus on the areas that you bring value to uh, so as you think through your small business concepts ideas your current small business I'm always going to encourage you to go back to the the core uh, services the core products that you bring to people because that's where your value is added and anything else that you want to do Grow your network, talk to more people, find out how you can serve them, and as a result, you're going to see uh, the tide lift all ships uh, for your industry, your product, your community, and that's really what we're talking about. Have a great day, guys. Bye-bye.